Russell Brand has been spotted for the first time as he told fans he was unable to discuss certain topics at a gig in Wembley tonight. The comedian and actor has been accused of rape, sexual assault and emotional abuse at the height of his fame in an investigation by The Times and Channel 4's dispatches. Four women are alleged to have come forward with claims, with the incidents taking place between 2006 and 2013. During this time Brand was a presenter on BBC Radio 2 and Channel 4 and starred in several Hollywood films. The comedian last night shared a video statement denying criminal and very serious allegations, which he said had been put to him in the form of a letter and email from an unnamed television program and newspaper. Brand appeared on stage on Saturday night, where he told crowds, there are things I absolutely cannot talk about. Breaking his cover, the actor was seen wearing a black jacket paired with jeans and white shoes as he wore a pair of oversized sunglasses over his face. While on stage at the Troubadour Theatre, he told the crowd of 2000, I really appreciate your support. I love you. I want to do a fantastic show for you. I've got a lot of things to talk to you about. There are obviously some things that I absolutely cannot talk about, and I appreciate that you will understand. The gig comes as a Channel 4 Dispatches program airs at 9pm highlighting Russell Brand's treatment of women. The program, which comes after a combined investigation with The Times and The Sunday Times, includes accounts from four women who allege Brand has assaulted them. The investigation, which reporters have been working on for over a year, has brought to light accusations of rape, sexual assault and emotional abuse. One account from a woman who alleges she was 16 and in school when an 31-year-old Russell Brand started a sexual relationship with her. In her accusations she says Brand forced his penis down her throat. In response to the allegations, Russell has denied all allegations and has said his relationships have all been consensual. He said, I've received two extremely disturbing letters or a letter and an email. One from a mainstream media TV company, one from a newspaper listing a litany of extremely egregious and aggressive attacks, as well as some pretty stupid stuff like community festival should be stopped, that I shouldn't be able to attack mainstream media narratives on this channel. But amidst this litany of astonishing rather broke attacks, often very serious allegations that I absolutely refute. These allegations pertain to the time when I was working in the mainstream, when I was in the newspapers all the time, when I was in the movies. And as I've written about extensively in my books, I was very, very promiscuous. If you've been a victim of sexual assault, you can access help and resources via www.rapecrisis.org.uk or calling the National Telephone Helpline on 0808 802 9999. Follow Mirror Celebs on Snapchat, Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, YouTube and Threads.